Hey everyone, I am here today to show you about my Wisdom Panel K9 DNA test. This is 4.0, this is their newest one, and it tests for 350 plus breeds, types, and varieties, and now it also screens for multi-drug sensitivity and exercise-induced collapse. So this is really neat. I have used Wisdom Panel in the past on my dog, Rue, and then um, the dog that we used to have, Kanga, and we loved the results that we got, um, and we were really impressed with it. So I want to go ahead and show you exactly what you're supposed to do with your wisdom panel test. So you're going to open it, and you already see that inside is your return box. So it already has tracking and everything on it, and it tells you do not destroy. This is your shipping container. So you're going to ship this exactly back the way it is. Okay. So... <clears throat> so basically what you're going to do with this is you have a swab. You have two swabs right here. So you're going to peel it back and you're going to save the sleeve. Don't throw away the sleeve. Um, it's going to tell you please wait about two hours after a meal or treat um, before collecting a DNA sample. So it's best to do this probably in the morning after they've slept. Um, then you're going to take the swab and you're going to obtain the cheek cells by basically rolling the bristles between the cheek and the gums. And then right here you have little holes so that you can air dry the swabs. And then you're going to go to activate my kit and you're going to put in your sample ID. Now right here, I'm not going to show you mine, but it is on the side. Find your sample ID right there. You're going to write it on the back of your swab label. On the back of this, I've already written um, my, my sample ID and also my name and my dog's name, which is Max. Then you're going to put the dry swabs right back into the sleeve. You're not going to seal it or else it can grow bacteria and it'll mess up your entire test. Then you're going to put the sleeve back into this box and you're going to mail it back and you will basically get your test results in your email. Now when you go to activate your kit um, on activatemykit.com you will get an option to make an account and I would definitely say to go ahead and make an account so that you can always log in and check everything. So basically this is how easy it is. Um, there's really no um, hard part of this other than trying to um, get the cheek cells and getting your dog to probably um, go ahead and uh, behave but um, and then you also do have two swabs so and you need to use both of them um, all the same swabs um, on the same pet so um, they'll you know just in case one didn't have a good sample or anything like that so you'll have um, you have two swabs right here to be able to use so that's pretty much it um, now I am using this kit on Max who was sold as a pure breed German Shepherd. So I want to see if he really is a pure breed German Shepherd. Now, um, Wisdom Panel can um, tell you what your mixed breeds are, so I am very curious to see. And if you want to check out what Max actually is, we will have a reveal video when we get his um, DNA results in our email. So if and I will show pictures of Max um, so that you can see and compare just exactly does he actually look like some of those breeds or did he really come out as a pure breed German Shepherd. So I hope you guys really enjoy this video and make sure to check out our reveal video when we have it coming out. 